day one might be the most pivotal day in your whole experience. And the reason why is because this is where we get a clear picture of where you currently are and where we want you to be. This is the day we're gonna sit down and look at what are the things that you need? Doctor skills, equipment, teammates, what documents haven't you created? We wanna look at your standard operating procedures. And from there, we're gonna to start to go through a few workshops. Three workshops are gonna be key. A consultation workshop, a consent workshop, and a charts note workshop. Now, these documents are so critical because we use them as a education tool. Communication is how we avoid problems within the practice. We avoid lawsuits. This is where we're gonna sit down and we're gonna look at that map that we give to patients and we train our employees with. We're gonna look at the financial agreements. We're gonna look at your consents, specifically your medical release, blood work. We're gonna look at all the documents that you use to communicate to a patient the process of all on X. Once these are complete, we're gonna move on to an exciting part, which is the marketing. Something that I've always been very passionate about. The way we market will determine the type of patients that come in the door. No more are we gonna market to everybody. We wanna to market to a very specific type of person. A person that resonates to your voice, to your message. We call it reverse marketing. And this is where you're gonna pre-frame patients, even in the marketing, about what they're gonna experience and why it is that they should pick you over anybody else. We're gonna look at the scripts for patients that call in, for your employees to be able to answer questions. How to answer certain questions will actually handle right there in the class. We're gonna look at CRMs and how you really aggregate all that information. We're gonna answer a big question, which is how do you market to patients out of state? And then what forms of marketing are the most useful when we're talking about all on X marketing within social media, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, we're gonna answer these questions. You're gonna have your mind exploded. It's gonna be incredible. I'm excited for you. Again, marketing is something that I've always really enjoyed. I got my MBA before I even graduated dental school. And marketing has always been something that just has always interested me because truly it's psychology, it's communication. Now, after we're done with marketing, we're gonna go into consultations and we're gonna actually work with doctors one-on-one -on -one to be able to make sure they understand what are the key points of how do you do a, a consultation. This is hard for some doctors, but it's really critical that you're able to know what it is that you're gonna cover in that space. What will you expect your teammates to cover? Lastly, we're gonna talk about something that is kind of scary, but it might be the most mind-blowing material that you experience here at Fearless Kingdom. It's called litigation. Now, I hope you haven't been through any lawsuits. Unfortunately, I can't say the same. But I went through these lawsuits and they helped me understand the full process. It was painful, it was hard, but I learned so much from it. You can be completely right and still doubt yourself. And so we're gonna look at the five most common mistakes people make when it comes to litigation. Getting clear around this so you don't have to be in fear anymore. If we really prepare and fortify by consents through standard operating procedures, through charting, so you never fear any type of lawsuit in the future. Lastly, we're gonna sit down and review an actual case, my case, and we'll look at what I could have done differently in order to be prepared for a lawsuit with this specific patient.